Today, this America's neighborhood is quiet, but last night, as neighbors attended church just down the street, shots rang out, leaving 62-year-old Martha Biggins dead and her son, 34-year-old Jesse Biggins Jr., with a bullet wound to his jaw. America's police say it all happened after an argument between Mrs. Biggins and her husband, 63-year-old Jesse Biggins Sr., over burnt cornbread. The argument was basically over and she had somehow involved uh, the children. They came to the house looking to see why he was jumping on her, and he told his son to get out of the house, and he, not doing so, he shot him with a 38 caliber pistol. He then went after his wife, who was shot at least five times. Detective J.G. Tondi says there were still 12 bullets left in the rifle. Biggins says the only reason he didn't empty the gun was because it jammed. People attending services here at this church tell police that when they heard the shots, they ran across the street only to find Jesse Biggins Sr. standing over the body of his wife. They tell police he then casually put the rifle over his shoulder, turned around, and walked away. When police arrived at the McCoy Street home, they found Biggins Sr. sitting on the front steps as if he were waiting for them. Chris Bavender, News Center 10, Americas. The argument was basically over, and she had somehow involved uh, the children. They came to the house looking to see why he was jumping on her, and he told his son to get out of the house, and he not doing so, he shot him with a 38 caliber pistol. here at this church tell police that when they heard the shots they ran across the street only to find Jesse Biggins senior standing over the body of his wife they tell police he then casually put the rifle over his shoulder turned around and walked away